Hi and welcome to Market Conversations. Just want to do a quick video on Bed Bath & Beyond. It was up 15% close at point 23, but before I continue, just want to let you know that I am not a financial advisor. This is just for entertainment purposes. Take, lo take a look at this 30 days, one hour chart. We did hit a high at point 0.357. This was back in May, and now here we are trying to break this strong resistance of point 0.23. So hopefully you break that get past this resistance at 0.35 and then hopefully we can see at least a dollar i do have shares and i'm not selling until i see that dollar so the news is overstock shares soar on successful 20.5 million dollar bid for bed bath and beyond assets overstock stock jump comes amid trading volume of 6.8 million shares fire and 12 percent higher than the stock's 65 day average the bid has a base purchase price of $21.5 million, according to a document filed in the United States Bankruptcy Court for the District of New Jersey Thursday. The asset purchase agreement includes all Bed Bath & Beyond's business IP, its business internet properties, and its mobile platform. Take a look at Reddit, Bed Bath & Beyond. We can see that now there's 66,000 members. And we can see some of these posts says new all-time high CTB 91.05% since listing on OTC no shares available for shorting and then we can see fun fact from 8k they generated 135 million cash in the month of May and used proceeds to pay off JP Morgan loan debt and then we can take a look down here so un so there's a question on unfunded and funded debt. So unfunded debt is a debt that is payable within a year. Funded debt is debt that is payable later than a year. Unfunded and funded debt can be both as secured and unsecured against assets and sources. Google says today's filings only includes funded debts totals and breakdowns. You'll be able to track the change from the initial bankruptcy funded debts totals to today's funded totals. You will not be able to track changes in the unfunded funded debt totals because there is no current unfunded debt total listing in this filing so not much we can really do except hold on to the shares and hopefully the stock will gain some momentum and we can fly back up to 0.35 and try to break that resistance and hit a dollar i'm not selling until it hits a dollar let me know your comments and thanks for watching